The Syro Malabar Catholic Church Aramaic, Syriac, Edta Katwoliuku Malabar Suryaya Edta Katholiki de Malabar Suryaya, Malayalam, Malabaral Suryani Katilika Sabah Malabaral Suryani Catholica Sabah or Church of Malabar Syrian Catholics is an Eastern Catholic major archiepiscopal church based in Kerala, India. It is a Sway Iuris particular church in full communion with the Pope and the worldwide Catholic Church, with self governance under the Code of Canons of the Eastern Churches. The Syro Malabar Church is headed by Major Archbishop Mar Cardinal George Alenkari of the Archipaki of Ernakulam Angamali in Kerala. The church uses the divine liturgy of Saints Mar Adai and March Mari belonging to the East Syriac Rite, which dates back to 3rd century Edessa, as such, it is a part of Syriac Christianity by liturgy and heritage. The name Syro Malabar is coined from the words Syriac referring to the East Syriac liturgy and Malabar the historical name for Kerala. The name has been in usage in official Vatican documents since the 19th century. As per Mar Paremakal Toma Kathaner's travelogue Varthamanapusthakam dated to 1790, the church was known then as the Malankari Kaldaya Suryani Sabah Malankara Chaldean Syriac Church. The Church shares the same liturgy with the Chaldean Catholic Church based in Iraq and the Chaldean Syrian Church based in Thrissur, Kerala which is an archbishopric of the Assyrian Church of the East based in Iraq. The Syro-Malabar Church is the third largest particular church sui juris in the Catholic Church after the Latin or Roman Church and the Ukrainian Catholic Church, the Syro-Malabar Church is the largest of the Nasrani St. Thomas Christians. Denominations with around 4.6 million believers and traces its origins to the evangelistic activity of Thomas the Apostle in the first century. Syro Malabar scholar and theologian Mar Placid Padapara describes the church as, Catholic by faith, Indian by culture, and East Syriac, Oriental in liturgy. The Syro Malabar church members are mostly of the Malayali ethnic group and their vernacular language is Malayalam. Although due to emigration of the members, various eparchies have opened up in other parts of India along with various parts in the rest of the world due to a worldwide Syro Malabar Malayali diaspora living in North America, Australia, and the United Kingdom. The members of the church are colloquially known in Kerala as Roman Catholic Syrian Christian and Syrian Catholic, and they have been known at various times as Nasrani, Catholic Syrian, Catholiska Kaldaya Syriani, Catholiska Nasrani, or St. Thomas Christian. Saint Alphonsa is the church's first canonized saint, followed by Saint Kuriakos Chavara and Saint Euphrasia. It is one of the two Eastern Catholic churches from India, the other one being the Syro Malankara Catholic Church, which uses the West Syriac Rite liturgy. History Kunin Cross Oath Topic. A protest took place in 1653 with the Kunin Cross Oath. Under the leadership of Archdeacon Thomas, the Thomas Christians publicly took an oath that they would not obey the Jesuit bishops or the Pope. Rome sent Carmelites in two groups from the propagation of the faith to Malabar headed by Fr. Sebastiani and Fr. Hyacinth. Fr. Sebastiani arrived first in 1655. He began to directly with the Archdeacon, Mar Toma Ifr. Sebastiani, with the help of Portuguese, gained the support of many, especially with the support of Palavidal Mar Chandi, Kadaval Chandi Kathaner and Vengor Givergais Kathaner. These were the three of the four councillors of Mar Toma I, who had been defected with Francisco Garcia Mendes, S.J., Archbishop of Cranganor, before the arrival of Sebastiani. According to Jesuit reports, between 1661 and 1662, out of the 116 churches, the Carmelites claimed 84 churches, leaving the native metropolitan Mar Toma I with 32 churches. The 84 churches and their congregations were the body from which the Syro Malabar Catholic Church has descended. The other 32 churches and their congregations represented the nucleus from which the Malankara Orthodox Syrian Church, the Thazir Church, Mar Toma Syrian, Reformed Syrians, Syro Malankara Catholic Church have originated. In 1665, Mar Gregorios, a bishop sent by the Syriac Orthodox Patriarch of Antioch, arrived in India. The independent group under the leadership of the Archdeacon welcomed him. 
Though most of the St. Thomas Christians gradually relented in their strong opposition to the Western control, the arrival of the Bishop Mar Gregorios of the Syriac Orthodox Church in 1665 marked the beginning of a formal schism among the St. Thomas Christians. Those who accepted the West Syriac liturgical tradition of the Syriac Orthodox Church of Antioch of Mar Gregorios became known as the Puthinkor. They also continued to use the name, Malankara, the real name of the St. Thomas Christian community for the Church. Those who joined the Communion of Rome after the Synod of Damper and remained in the Communion even after the Oath of Bent Cross, and those who joined the Catholic Communion from the Puhankor Malankara Church during the Carmelite period, came to be known as the Syro Malabar Church from the last decade of the 19th century onwards. Some of the churches not joined in the Angamali Patiola later became Latin churches, e.g., Madalakam, Papinavadam, Maliankara, Thiruthipuram, etc. One branch of the Syro Malabar Catholic Church later left to form the Assyrian Church of the East aligned Chaldean Syrian Church when an Eastern Syriac Rite Bishop, Mar Gabriel, came to evangelize them in 1701. Khatiyam Cheriapali was the headquarters of Mar Gabriel. <laughs> Restoration of the Syro Malabar Hierarchy after the split in the church community, the Catholics of the Malabar coast faced an identity crisis and thus some priests and laymen attempted to persuade the hierarchy to improve the identity of the local church and for the appointment of bishops from local priests. To represent their position, Kerala's Syrian Catholics Joseph Cariatal and Paremakal Tama Kathaner went to Rome in 1778. While they were in Europe, Cariati Joseph Kathaner was installed in Portugal as the Archbishop of Codingalor Archdiocese. While journeying home, they stayed in Goa where Cariatal died before he could formally take charge. Before he died, Cariatal appointed Kathaner as the administrator of Kodingalore Archdiocese after him. The new administrator ran the affairs of the church establishing his headquarters at Angamali. In 1790, the headquarters of the archdiocese was shifted to Videyar dodging the invasion of Tipu Sultan. In the last four years of his life, Tama Kathaner managed church administration from his own parish, Ramapuram. After being under Babylonian Assyrian Church of the East, Catholic faction of this church is known as Chaldean Catholic Church from 1681, bishops earlier and under Latin Church Roman Catholic bishops from 1599, Catholics of St. Thomas Christians obtained their own bishops from 1896. They were known as Catholic Chaldean Syrians during the period from around 1787 Angamali to around 1911. They were known as the Catholic Syrians or Romo-Syrians to differentiate them from the Orthodox Syrians and Latin Church Catholics in Kerala. They came to be known as the Syro-Malabar Catholics from 1932 onwards to differentiate them from the Syro-Malankara Catholics in Kerala. The Indian East Syriac Catholic hierarchy was restored on 21 December 1923 with March Augustine Kandathal as the first metropolitan and head of the church with the name Syro Malabar. Topic timeline of events Topic Timeline of events 1 Ancient Era 2 Portuguese Era 3 Era of Divisions 4 The Dark Era of Invasions 5 Era of Self-Governance 6 A Sway Iuris Church, 7 Title Restoration Topic Syro Malabar Identity Topic Syro Malabar Historian and Theologian Fr. Placid Padapara describes it as Catholic by faith, Indian by culture and East Syrian, Syriac, Oriental in liturgy. Today, the Syro-Malabar Church finds herself as the second largest Eastern Catholic Church in the world with over 4.6 million members worldwide. Topic faith and communion of Syro-Malabarians The St. Thomas Christians got their bishops from the Assyrian Church of the East, Chaldean Church from C.A. 300 AD till the end of the 16th century, until it was stopped by the Portuguese Roman Catholics in 1597, after the death of Mar Abraham. Topic liturgy Topic As per the East Syriac tradition, liturgical day of the Syro-Malabar Church starts at sunset 6 PM. Also the worshipper has to face the East while worshipping. This is not followed after Latinization, according to the East Syriac Orthodox tradition which was prevalent before the induction of Catholicism, the following are the seven times of prayer, Ramsha, Ramsha or the evening liturgy 6 p.m. Suba, Swaba or the supper liturgy 9 p.m. Lelya, Lelya or the night liturgy 12 a.m. Qalad Shara, Kala Shara or the vigil liturgy 3 a.m. Sapra, Sapra or the morning liturgy 6 a.m. Kudas, Kuda or the third hour liturgy 9 a.m. Endana, Edana 
or the noon liturgy 12 p.m. The Holy Mass, which is called Holy Kurbana in East Syriac Aramaic and means Eucharist, is celebrated in its solemn form on Sundays and special occasions. During the celebration of the Kurbana, priests and deacons put on elaborate vestments which are unique to the Syro-Malabar Catholic Church. Topic restoration of East Syriac Liturgy Topic East Syriac Liturgy has three anaphory, those of the Holy Apostles Saints Adai and Mari, Mar Nestorius, and Mar Theodore the Interpreter. The first is the most popularly and extensively used. The second was traditionally used on the Epiphany and the feasts of Saint John the Baptist and of the Greek doctors, both of which occur in Epiphany Tide on the Wednesday of the Regation of the Ninevites, and on Maundy Thursday. The third is used except when the second is ordered from Advent to Palm Sunday. The same pro-anaphoral part serves for all three. In the second half of 20th century, there was a movement for better understanding of the liturgical rites. A restored Eucharistic liturgy, drawing on the original East Syriac sources, was approved by Pope Pius XII in 1957 and for the first time on the Feast of St. Thomas on July 3, 1962, the vernacular, Malayalam, was introduced for the celebration of the Syro-Malabar Kurbana. Currently they celebrate the Divine Liturgy of Adai and Mari and the Anaphora of Mar Theodra in mostly Malayalam, with Syriac and English influences. Besides the anaphora of Mara Dai and Mari being used currently in Syro Malabar liturgy, there are two more anaphora known as anaphora of Mar Theodore and anaphora of Mar Nestorius. That the anaphora of Mar Theodore, which was withdrawn from use after the Synod of Diemper, a large number of churches used it up to 1896, is being used again in Syro Malabar Church after 415 years is indeed an important historical reality. In a way, Syro Malabar Church rejected Synod of Diemper Pope Pius XII during the process of restoration of the Syro Malabar Kurbana in 1957 had requested the restoration of the anaphora of Mar Theodore and Mar Nestorius. The draft of the anaphora of Mar Theodore was restored after meticulous study by the Central Liturgical Committee, Liturgical Research Center, various sub-committees and the Eparchial Liturgical Commissions. Many changes befitting to the times have been made in the prayers maintaining maximum fidelity to the original text of the second anaphora. It was this text so prepared that was sent to Rome for the recognition of the Apostolic See in accordance with the decision of the Syro-Malabar Synod. The Congregation for the Eastern Churches gave its approval for using this anaphora on an experimental basis for three years on 15 December 2012. The Latinization of the Syro Malabar Rite churches was brought to a head when in 1896 Ladislaus Zaleski, the Apostolic Delegate to India, requested permission to translate the Roman Pontifical into Syriac. This was the choice of some Malabar prelates, who chose it over the East Syriac Rite and West Syriac Rite Pontificals. A large number of Syro Malabarians were Assyrian schismatics at that time, and various problems and concerns delayed the approval of this translation, until in 1934 Pope Pius XI stated that Latinization was no longer to be encouraged among Eastern Rite Catholics. He initiated a process of liturgical reform that sought to restore the Oriental nature of the Latinized Syro Malabar Rite. A restored Eucharistic liturgy, drawing on the original East Syriac sources, was approved by Pius XII in 1957 and introduced in 1962. The Church uses one of several Bible translations into Malayalam. <laughs> <laughs> Liturgical calendar Syro-Malabar Church has its own liturgical year. It is ordered according to the flow of salvation history. It focuses on the historical life of Jesus. There are nine seasons for the liturgical year. They are Annunciation Nativity of Jesus Epiphany Great Fast Resurrection Apostles Summer Elijah Cross Moses Elijah Sleba Muse Dedication of the Church Cutas Edta Topic Major Feasts Topic Major Feasts of the Church are Dukrana of the Father in Faith, Mar Toma Shlia commemorated on July 3rd, Marth Alfonsa, commemorated the 28th of July, Saint Kuriakos Elias Chavara, commemorated the 3rd of January. Mar Varghese Payapili Palakapili, commemorated 5 October Saint Euphrasia, commemorated 29 August 
Mar Bartholomeo Sliha, commemorated 24 August Marth Shmani and her seven children, commemorated 21 August The Assumption of Saint Mary Shunaya, commemorated on 15 August Transfiguration Jelayana, commemorated 6 August Mar Adai and March Mari, commemorated on the second Friday of Kata summer. The Twelve Apostles of Our Lord, Iso Missia, commemorated 19 July the Seventy Apostles, commemorated 17 July Mar Kariakos and Mother Yolath, commemorated 15 July March Prem commemorated, commemorated 9 June Blessed Mariam Thresha, commemorated 8 June Holy Pentecost, commemorated on 31 May The Ascension of Our Lord, Iso Missia, Sulaka, commemorated 21 May Mar Adai Shliya, commemorated 10 May Mar Givergay's Sahada, commemorated the 24th of April. New Sunday, commemorated the 19th of April. All Saints' Day, commemorated on the first Friday of the season of resurrection. Entry of Our Lord, Iso Missia into Jerusalem, Oshana Sunday. The Annunciation of Saint Mary, Subara, commemorated the 25th of March. Remembrance of all departed faithful, Kol Anida, commemorated on last Friday of Denha. The Feast of Denha, the Epiphany, commemorated on 6 January The Nativity of Our Lord, God and Saviour Iso Masiha Yalda, commemorated 25 December Mar Toma Sliva, commemorated 18 December Immaculate Conception of Saint Mary, commemorated 8 December March Augustinos Kunjachin, commemorated 16 October Passover Feast Pesha Syro-Malabar hierarchy Syro-Malabar major archiepiscopal curia The curia of the Syro-Malabar Church began to function in March 1993 at the Archbishop's House of Ernakulam Angamali. Later, on 27 May 1995, it was shifted to new premises at Mount St. Thomas near Kakanad, Kochi. The newly constructed curial building was opened on 3 July 1998. The administration of the Syro-Malabar Church has executive and judicial roles. The major archbishop, officials, various commissions, committees, and the permanent synod form the executive part. The permanent synod and other offices are formed in accordance with the CCEO. The officials include the Chancellor, Vice-Chancellor, and other officers. Various commissions are appointed by the Major Archbishop, Liturgy, Pastoral Care of the Migrant and Evangelization, Particular Law, Catechism, Ecumenism, Catholic Doctrine, Clergy and Institutes of Consecrated Life and Societies of Apostolic Life. The members of the commissions are ordinarily bishops. But there are also priests in different commissions. For judicial activities there is the major archiepiscopal ordinary tribunal formed in accordance with CCEO and it has a statutes and sufficient personnel with a president, as its head. At present, Rev. Dr. José Chiramel is the president. The major archiepiscopal curia functions in the curial building in Kerala, India. They have prepared the particular law for their church and promulgated part by part in Synodal News, the official bulletin of this church. There are statutes for the permanent synod, for the superior and ordinary tribunals. Regarding Economo, CCEOC. 122 Section 2 is specific in the particular law, that the term of the office shall be five years and the same person shall not be appointed for more than two terms consecutively. <laughs> Provinces, arch, eparchies and other jurisdictions there are 31 eparchies dioceses. Five of them are archiparchies at present, all in southern India. The major archbishops see Ernakulam Angamali, Changanasheri, Trichore, Telicheri and Kadiyam. Those have another 13 suffragan eparchies, Bhadravathi, Belthangadi, Irinyalakuda, Kanjirapali, Kathamangalam, Idukki, Mananthavadi, Mandya, Palai, Palghat, Ramanathapuram, Thamarasari and Thukkalai within the canonical territory of the major archiepiscopal church. 
There are 13 further eparchies outside the canonical territory of which Adilabad, Bijnor, Chanda, Gorakhpur, Jagdalpur, Kalyan, Raikat, Sagar, Satna and Ujjain in India are with exclusive jurisdiction and Kalyan, Faridabad eparchies in India, the St. Thomas Eparchy of Chicago in the United States of America and St. Thomas the Apostle Eparchy of Melbourne in Australia enjoy personal jurisdiction. Topic. Proper ecclesiastical provinces Topic. Most believers of this church are organized under five metropolitan archiparchies archdiocese, all in Kerala, and their suffragan eparchies. Major Archipaki of Ernakulam Angamali Eparchy of Idukki Eparchy of Kothamangalam Metropolitan Archipaki Changanasari Eparchy of Kanjurapali Eparchy of Palai Eparchy of Thukkalai Archipaki of Khatiyam nominally Metropolitan, No Suffragan Metropolitan Archipaki of Telicheri Eparchy of Belthangadi Eparchy of Bhadravathi Eparchy of Mananthavadi Eparchy of Mandya Eparchy of Thamarasari Metropolitan Archipaki of Thrissur Eparchy of Irinyalakuta Eparchy of Palghat Eparchy of Ramanatha Purim topic eparchies outside Kerala topic Eparchy of Bijnar Eparchy of Gorakhpur Eparchy of Sagar Eparchy of Satna Eparchy of Ujjain Eparchy of Kalyan Eparchy of Raikat Eparchy of Adilabad Eparchy of Chanda Eparchy of Jagdalpur topic Exempt jurisdictions topic Eparchy of Faridabad, near Delhi, also serves Haryana, Indian Punjab, Himachal Pradesh, Jammu and Kashmir and parts of Uttar Pradesh Eparchy of Hosur, in Tamil Nadu, established October 2017 Eparchy of Shamshabad, includes the entire country of India not included in existing eparchies, established October 2017 outside India, Apostolic Exarchate of Canada Eparchy of Melbourne, for Australia Eparchy of Chicago, for the USA Eparchy of Great Britain in Preston, England for England, Wales and Scotland topic Syro Malabar Religious Congregations topic The religious congregations are divided in the Eastern Catholic Church Law Code of Canons of the Oriental Churches, CCEO as monasteries, hermitages, or orders, congregations, societies of common life in the manner of religious, secular institutes and societies of apostolic life. Active are, Carmelites of Mary Immaculate Congregation of the Mother of Carmel Little Flower Congregation Franciscan Clarist Congregation Missionary Congregation of the Blessed Sacrament Missionary Society of St. Thomas the Apostle Sisters of the Adoration of the Blessed Sacrament Adoration Congregation Vincentian Congregation Nazareth Sisters Topic Statistics Topic According to the Annuario Pontificio the Pontifical Yearbook for 2016 there were about 4,189,349 members in the Syro Malabar Church. Topic within the proper territory topic There are 16 eparchies in the proper territory of the Syro Malabar Church. Archipaki of Ernakulam Angamali has 510,000 members with 347 parishes, 731 religious, secular priests, 632 male religious, and 4,935 female religious. Archipaki of Trichor has 471,328 members with 195 parishes, 418 religious, secular priests, 358 male religious and 3,315 female religious. Eparchy of Idukki has 270,000 members with 129 parishes, 119 religious, secular priests, 109 male religious and 1320 female religious. Archipaki of Changanasheri has 390,000 members with 266 parishes, 615 religious, secular priests, 534 male religious and 2,705 female religious. Eparchy of Palai has 348,128 members with 169 parishes, 502 religious, secular priests, 127 male religious and 3,312 female religious. Archipaki of Telicheri has 317,782 members with 222 parishes, 293 religious, secular priests, 263 male religious and 1664 female religious. Eparchy of Irinyalakuda has 258,200 members with 128 parishes, 233 religious, secular priests, 132 male religious and 2,350 female religious. Eparchy of Kothamangalam has 217,420 members with 115 parishes, 242 religious, secular priests, 163 male religious and 2,210 female religious. 
Eparchy of Kanjirapali has 192,000 members with 136 parishes, 314 religious, secular priests, 210 male religious and 1840 female religious. Archipaki of Khatiyam has 175,300 members with 149 parishes, 161 religious, secular priests, 107 male religious and 1233 female religious. Eparchy of Mananthavadi has 170,100 members with 140 parishes, 413 religious, secular priests, 358 male religious and 1546 female religious. Eparchy of Thamarasari has 129,600 members with 128 parishes, 247 religious, secular priests, 257 male religious and 1321 female religious. Eparchy of Palghat has 68,004 members with 106 parishes, 167 religious, secular priests, 82 male religious, and 1360 female religious. According to a study conducted, in Kerala, about 30% of the Syro Malabar church members lived in the erstwhile Cochin state. The remaining 70% lived in Travancore state, citation needed. In the Travancore state, Meenashal Taluk had the largest proportion, followed by Changanasari Taluk. Erstwhile Cochin State, Meenashal and Changanasari together had 56% of the total Syro Malabar population. Khatiyam, Muvatupuza, Kanjirapali, Thodupuza, Kathamangalam, Chirthala, Mukandapuram, Irinyalakuta Chalakudi, Wadakancheri, Thrissur, North Purur, Alway, Kunathunadu, Ambalapuza, Kutanad, Piramedu, Nedam Kondam, and Devakulam, etc., are the prominent Taliks. Outside the proper territory There are eleven eparchies outside the proper territory of the Syro Malabar Church. The eparchy of Kalyan has 100,000 members with 106 parishes, 146 religious, secular priests, 105 male religious, and 270 female religious. St. Thomas Syro Malabar Catholic Diocese of Chicago, USA has 85,000 members with 11 parishes, 45 religious, secular priests, 13 male religious and 16 female religious. The Eparchy of Canada has 14,079 members with 5 parishes, 51 religious, secular priests, 182 male religious and 352 female religious. The Eparchy of Adilabad, has 13,273 members with 25 parishes, 50 religious, secular priests, 41 male religious and 143 female religious. The Eparchy of Rikot has 12,850 members with 12 parishes, 140 religious, secular priests, 142 male religious and 421 female religious. There is a significant diaspora of Syro-Malabar Catholics in countries not under the jurisdiction of any of the existing eparchies. <laughs> Saints, blesseds, venerables and servants of God <laughs> Saints Mar Thoma Sliha, Apostle and Founder of the Syro Malabar Church, Marth Alfonso, Religious Sister of FCC Congregation, Mar Kuriakos Elias Chavara, Priest and Founder of CMI, Marth Euphrasia Aluvathingal, Religious Sister of CMC Congregation Beatified people Marth Mariam Thresha Churamel, Religious Sister and Founder of Holy Family Congregation March Augustine the Varparambal Kunjachin, Priest Marth Rani Maria 1954 Religious Sister of FCC Congregation Venerables <inaudible> 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 Mar Payapili Varghese Kathaner, priest and founder of Sisters of the Destitute 1876 Mar Thomas Karelachari, first bishop of Archipaki of Changanasari Mar Kadalikatil Matai Kathaner, priest 1872 
Mar Joseph Vithayathal, priest and co-founder of Holy Family Congregation 1865 <laughs> <laughs> Servants of God Mar Matthew Makel, 1851–1914 Mar Tamiyachin Puthathal, 1871–1943 Marth Mary Celine Payapilli, 1906–1993 March Augustine John Uchen, 1880–1956 Mar Joseph C. Panjikaran, 1888–1949 Mar Antony Thatchuparambal, 1894–1963 Mar Matthew Cavacott, 1904 to 1969. Marth Maria Celine Canonical, 1931 to 1957. Mar Thomakin Puthan Parimple. Mar Canisius C M I, 1914 to 1998. Topic. Flag. Topic. Syro Malabar flag contains the St. Thomas cross at the center, surrounded by three budded crosses on both sides. Mar Walla my Lord and my God, is written in East Syriac below the St. Thomas cross. The flag is flown or displayed worldwide in Syro Malabar churches and institutions. Topic. List of prominent Syro Malabar Catholics in history Topic. Topic. Prominent Syro-Malabar Catholics who worked for Unity of Nasranis Topic. Mar Joseph Cariadal Paremakal Toma Kathaner Nidhairi Mani Kathaner Placid J. Potapara Varthamanapusthakam the Varthamanapusthakam is the first travelogue written in the Malayalam language. It is written by Paremakal Toma Kathanar. It describes the history of the Nasrani Church between the years 1773 and 1786 with emphasis on the journey of its author and Malpin Mar Ausip Joseph Cariadal from Malabar to Rome via Lisbon and back. Despite attempts by European ecclesiastical authorities to destroy it the major part of this book survived. Topic. Shared history with other St. Thomas Christians Topic. Topic. Mar Abraham of Angamali Topic. Abraham of Angamali Syriac, Burm Mountain Mar Abraham died c. 1597 was the last in the long line of Mesopotamian bishops who governed the Church of St. Thomas Christians. In spite of the express approbation of the Pope, he was not welcomed by the Portuguese ecclesiastical authorities. Mar Abraham died in January 1597 at Angamali and his body was buried in Mar Hormuz Syro Malabar Catholic Church, Angamali Old Cathedral Church. Topic see also topic Sisters of the Destitute Carmelites of Mary Immaculate Congregation of St. Therese of Lisieux All India Catholic Union Catholic Church in India Syro Malankara Catholic Church Syrian Malabar Nasrani topic References topic topic References and bibliography topic topic External links topic Syro Malabar Church Archdiocese of Thrissur Archdiocese of Khatiyam Archdiocese of Changanasheri Archdiocese of Ernakulam Angamali Archdiocese of Telicheri The website for Synod of Diamper Indian Christianity, books by Geddes, Mackenzie, Medlicott, and C. The Chennai Mission Syro Malabar Mission in Chennai Syro Malabar Church in Australia Nazrani Heritage Syro Malabar Church in Qatar Syro Malabar Matrimony Article on the Syro Malabar Catholic Church by Ronald Roberson on the CNEWA website <laughs>